YouTube, what's going on? BD Keen 721. It's a Thursday afternoon. Got a one package mail day to share with you today. I don't seem to be getting too many packages in the mail recently just because I've been waiting to have things delivered to me uh, as well as I've just not been buying as much recently. But I did get a really good deal on some cards from a, uh, a guy on blowoutcards.com. And he was nice enough to send them to me for a really good deal from Canada, yet. So, I got these cards from Canada. Okay, looks like he put them in individual little packets. So let's just pull them out. Make sure there's none left in here. Nope. Okay, so he's got them in four little individually wrap packets. He did not put each card in a top loader, which kind of bums me out a little bit because the cards are loose. They're together in each one of these, but you can see they're, looks like they might be in a team bag. So, and you can see how they come out of the packaging that way. So some of these might have some condition issues unless I got lucky and they didn't shift around too much but that package was not very tightly wrapped or secured inside so it's very possible these cards are not going to be in perfectly mint condition actually they're not even team bags they're just larger penny sleeves so these are all 2013 refractors sepia or black so as you can see we've got sepia here adam dunn tommy malone so i would grade this this delivery for the money i spent probably about a d plus this is not the way you want to send your cards to whoever you sell or trade them to um, it looks like so far these cards are turning out to be in decent shape um, you might have seen his post there's a nice one Pedroia. you might have seen his post on blowout that he opened I think he said he opened eight cases of Topps Chrome from 2013 and he had a lot of cards that he was trying to get rid of and so I snatched up all of the refractors the black and the sepias because the blues he didn't have any that I that I needed so so far they're not too bad these are the blacks or this this package has some blacks in them and I'm just kind of looking at them sorry this is going to take a little while I'm just kind of looking at them just to see here's a nice jerks and profar and actually they're not too bad so far so I can't complain too much I've not seen one with any kind of noticeable defect. Um, even though I'm not concentrated on, on these two sets right now, the black refractor set, I actually need about 90 or so cards to complete that. So that's my next, once I get the 2012 chrome set uh, blue chrome finished, a blue refractor finished. This one may be eh, not too bad. Josh Hamilton, Alex Cologne. I'm kind of a half expecting the cars to have some rounded corners, but so far they're not really that bad. I think the tally was 36 cards. He gave me an awesome price on them. I think there were 18, oh, I'm sorry, like 16 black refractors and 20 sepia. Here this might be the first one. Looking at it closer here off camera. 
the Will Myers there in the in the bottom. I can't really see it on this camera, but in the bottom left hand corner it might be a little bit rounded. Not terrible though. And then the last pack. So if you guys have any of these cards that you're willing to get let go of, please feel free to let me know. Be happy to take them off your hands. I have to say I'm pretty surprised at the condition of these. I still don't recommend the way he packaged them up. If you're going to do it that way, at least put them in a package that the cards are not going to move around very much. All right, that's it. So pretty cool. There's my stack of sepias. There's my stack of black refractors. And I hope you enjoyed it. Sorry for the long video. I just figured I would look at them all as I went through them. Hope you enjoyed it. And I will talk to you guys later. See you.